TSA raises groping fees charged to passengers. Yeah, you didn't know that you're actually paying these people to touch you. So uh, isn't, that, isn't that not prostitution? That's state-sponsored mandatory prostitution when you go to the airport. That's what it is. Fees are currently $250 for a nonstop flight or $5 for a trip with a layover. But the next month's increase that Congress approved back in December, the new fees will be $560 for a nonstop flight and an extra $560 for each leg of the trip when flights are over four hours apart. So, yeah, state-sponsored mandatory prostitution when you go to the airport. You say, oh, you're being extreme. There's nothing wrong with these people touching you and all this stuff. Oh, really? We've shown you the montages all the time, how they touch the kids. Uh, they were touching on Mini-Me last week. All kinds of weird shenanigans going on with the TSA. And not to mention, they have not caught a single terrorist. And you say, hold on, I'm remembering, I'm remembering something. Didn't they catch the underwear bomber? No, they did not catch the underwear bomber. The people on that plane stopped the underwear bomber, not the TSA. All right, so this would be the equivalent of saying you caught, uh, you know, the mass murderer. I caught the mass murderer when he came to my house to kill me. Or the police say that. The, we caught the mass murderer. I was like, no, nah, man, the dude kicked in my door and I beat him up or I shot him or my dog bit him. And then I held him here until you got here. I caught the mass murderer, not you. TSA has not stopped a single terrorist. But the security theater, the, secu the security shenanigans continue to go on with this organization and they just need to get out of our lives altogether.